I'm going to create this shape in Tinkercad. It's a rectangle with rounded corners that are set to a specific radius called a fillet. To make this happen, I have to take a box and cut the corners off. I'm going to drag out a new box and set it to the dimensions that I want. I could create my own cutting tool using a cylinder and a box, but instead I'm going to use a shape generator that's already been created for this task. Shape generators are scripts created by Tinkercad users that can make all sorts of shapes. To look through the collection, I can come over here and click on basic shapes and then select shape generators, toggle this over to all and scroll through this very, very long list. Instead, I'm going to use the search and look for Metafillet. I'm going to use the inspector to adjust the shape instead of dragging the corners on the work plane. Shape generators can get buggy if you don't. So I want a 17 degree radius. So I'm just gonna type 17 in here. And then I'm gonna set my height to something taller than my box. I know my box was 20 millimeters, so I'm gonna make this 25. This will give me a little bit of extra room to grab onto the shape. Now that I have my fillet set correctly, I can change it to a hole and then use the align tool to align it with the box. So I don't wanna move the box, so I'm just gonna click on it once to relocate my alignment handles. And now I can align it to the corner like that. Now, instead of repeating that whole process, I'm just gonna duplicate and then I'm gonna use mirror to make a new corner and then align that on the other side. Okay, now I can do the same for these two at the same time, mirror it this way select my box as well, and drop it down there. So once I feel like this looks good, I just have to select everything and group it to apply that cut.